snail farming and rabbit farming may not be the first things that come to mind when you think of livestock farming. But trust me, they have their own incredible merits and can be a highly profitable venture. The question is, how do they fare against each other? Today, we'll be exploring the key aspects, differences, and similarities between these two unconventional farming practices. From space requirements, initial investment, feed and nutrition, market demand, profitability, labor, and maintenance, we'll cover it all. So, sit back, relax, and get ready to expand your knowledge and appreciation for the world of alternative livestock farming. Kindly like this video if you find it useful and consider subscribing to this channel. 1. Space Requirements Snails can be reared in relatively small spaces, such as containers or small pens. A small-scale snail farm can be started in a backyard or garden. Rabbits require more space compared to snails. They are usually raised in hutches or cages. Adequate space is needed for their movement and exercise. 2. Initial Investment The initial investment for setting up a snail farm is relatively low. It primarily involves the cost of acquiring snail stock, constructing suitable housing, and providing basic infrastructure like water source, feeding trough etc. Rabbit farming may require a higher initial investment as it involves the purchase of rabbits, construction of rabbit hutches or cages, and provision of necessary equipment such as feeders and waterers. 3. Feed and Nutrition Snails are herbivores and can feed on a variety of vegetation, including leaves, fruits, and vegetables. Their diet consists of easily available and inexpensive feed options. Rabbits are herbivores and require a diet rich in fiber. They primarily consume hay, grass, and fresh vegetables. Their diet may be relatively more expensive compared to snails due to the need for a diverse range of feed sources. 4. Reproduction and Breeding Snails are hermaphrodites, meaning they have both male and female reproductive organs. They can reproduce rapidly, with each snail laying hundreds of eggs. Snail population can overwhelm you if provision is not made for expansion. Rabbits reproduce sexually, with separate male and female individuals. They have a relatively shorter gestation period and can produce multiple litters in a year. Breeding rabbits requires careful pairing and management. 5. Market Demand and Profitability Snail farming has gained popularity due to the increasing demand for snail meat, which is considered a delicacy in many cuisines. This growing popularity can also be attributed to the increasing demand for snail slime which is an expensive commodity used in the cosmetic and skincare industry due to its tremendous benefits for the skin. Rabbit meat is lean, nutritious, and has a niche market. While the demand for rabbit meat varies across regions, it may not be as high as the demand for snail meat. Profitability in rabbit farming depends on market demand and effective marketing strategies. 6. Labor and Maintenance Snail farming requires relatively less labor compared to rabbit farming. Snails are low-maintenance animals, and their farming activities mainly involve feeding, cleaning, and providing suitable conditions for their growth. Rabbit farming requires more attention and care. Regular feeding, cleaning of hutches slash cages, and monitoring of rabbit health are necessary. Additional efforts are also needed for breeding and managing the growing rabbit population. Both snail farming and rabbit farming have their advantages and considerations. The choice between the two depends on factors such as available resources, market demand, personal preferences, and the suitability of the farming method to the local environment. If you'll love to learn more about snails or how snail farming compares to other types of livestock farming like pig, fish, or goat farming, click on the playlist link displayed in the comment section below. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, kindly like, share, and consider subscribing to this channel. Have a lovely day.